throughout this document. John Whitting there. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Uh, would my right of friend agree that soft power can often be as effective as hard power, if not more so, and it is usually a lot cheaper? Um, can I therefore strongly welcome the additional funding for the BBC World Service? Yeah. But will he go on and look at strengthening support for other soft power projections, such as the British Council and the Chevening Scholarship and John Smith Fellowship programmes? Yeah. Yeah. Thursday, uh, my right honourable friend, uh, my near neighbour in Essex, I suspect knows that he is pushing at the openest of open doors uh, with regard to that. I'm, I, I, I don't particularly like the phrase soft power because I think it sometimes implies a subordinate relationship to hard power. And he is absolutely right that the UK's... I'm going to have to use it because I haven't thought of anything else better yet, but the UK's projection of soft power is so incredibly powerful. It is incredibly cost-effective. And the... And the, uh, and, and the um, and the points that you made about cheapening scholars, martial scholars and other football, arts, theatre, all these things are incredibly powerful and absolutely at the heart of UK uh, foreign policy. Stuart M. Macdonald. 